Old England. Today on One House. And now is the guy who puts the fun in Fun House, oi, J.D. Ross. Yeah. Hey, Jay. What's up, big guy? Hey. I'm you, see, I heard what he said, but he's wrong. You're not going to need this crown. Yes, I do, Jay. Today we're saluting good old England. No, 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 Tiny, not old England. Today we're honoring New England. New England? Right, exactly. Oh. Today, we're going to be dedicating a ton of Funhouse Clops to three New England states. So Maine, New Hampshire, and Vermont, get ready. We're putting you on the map today. Okay. There's Maine. There's New Hampshire, and there's Vermont right now. To bring on today's players, meet our twin cheerleaders, Jackie and Sammy. Team. They were friends for seven years ago. Tim Brockman and Adam Riker. Yeah. Yeah. Gold and gold. We were friends for three years. We have Barbie Van Hook and David Woodley. Yeah. yeah. How you doing? I'm great. Uh, you'd like to say hello to someone back at home. First tell us where home is and then tell us who it is. Home is in Minneapolis, Minnesota. And I'd like to say hi to Jeremy Moman, who's sick, and tell him to get, get well soon. All right, Adam, how you doing? Just great. Where are you from? Minneapolis, Minnesota. Also. You both live there, huh? Yeah. What school do you go to? Robbinsdale Armstrong. High All right, it's here for the red team. Yeah. What's up, David? Uh, this guy, why don't you tell him what you are? I'm a Trekkie. Now, uh, what, tell him what a Trekkie means real quick. Oh, you're a fan of Star Trek. And who's your favorite character? Lieutenant Commander Data. All right, you like Data. I like that, too. The, that's the new Star Trek. Barbie, how you doing? Fine. What do you like to do in your spare time? Gymnastics. And your favorite move? Um, Hand, can you do a handstand? Yeah. All right, it's here for the gold team. Hey, it's showtime. We're going to play Funhouse now. I'm taking the guys with me. Let's go, guys. All right, now, you see, we got this letter from a guy named Peter Albert in Westbrook, Maine. So this stunt is especially for Peter and all of our other fans in Maine. Now, Maine is famous all over the world for its lobsters. We call this stunt bobbing for lobsters. Now we have loads of make-believe lobsters floating in a vat of seawater, sea foam, and seaweed. Ugh, yuck. Now a guy's job is to get all the lobsters they can out of the little ocean and drop them in these lobster buckets. But they gotta do it the funhouse way, with their teeth. Most lobsters in the bucket after 30 seconds is gonna win the points. Let's set the clock. Hey. Guys, you ready? This is gonna be great. On your mark. Get set, go! Come on, guys. All right, try to get as many lobsters as they can in there. That's gonna win the stunt. Come on, guys. Come on, guys. First, that, that tastes pretty disgusting, didn't it? Yeah, I don't blame you. All right, we're gonna go over here. We got one lobster, two lobster. We'll put them back in the tank. We want them to survive. Now over here, you got enough for a whole family, pal. I don't believe this. All right, we're gonna let you take these home. All right, we got one lobster. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight lobsters. Red, gold team, you in the spot. Here we go. All right, uh, we're gonna go back and award the points. Let's go. All right, now, as you may have noticed, we already went to Maine. Next, we're going to go to Vermont and then back to New Hampshire. All right, for winning that stunt, we're going to give the gold team 25 points. Ready for this question, girls? Real lobsters, like the one in that stunt, are shellfish. Which of these fish is also a shellfish? A shark, shrimp, or dolphin? Pam. A shrimp. Shrimp is right for 25 oh. points. At the end of our stunt round, we got a 25 points apiece. Time to take a break now. But our next stop is Vermont, and I promise you, it's going to be icky, sticky Vermont and maple syrup flying all over the place. Stay with us. And now, back to Funhouse and that host, J.D. Ross. Oh, yeah. Our next New England state is Vermont. Now, what are, when I say Vermont, what do you think of? Maple syrup. 
Maple syrup, of course, maple syrup. Look at this, gooey, icky, disgusting maple syrup. I love maple syrup. Mm. That is direct from our maple tree. Now, because pancakes and maple syrup taste so great, our cooks are getting ready to serve pancakes and syrup the Funhouse way. Here's how they're gonna do it. The girls are gonna take one of these giant pancakes soaking in phony butter and load in the humongous pancake flipper. Then they're gonna run around in the front of it, yell out one flapjack and jump on the handle. The guys are gonna have to catch the pancake on their plate, pour the sticky Vermont syrup all over it. And that's all there is to it. But if a flapjack hits the floor, it's out of play and unedible. The team that builds the biggest stack of pancakes and syrup in 45 seconds is gonna win the stunt. Set the clock. In position. On your mark. Get set. Go. down here first of all come on over here uh pam scream as loud as you can one flapjack one flapjack all right but you forgot to do it pam what am i gonna do with you scream one flapjack one flapjack you got you forgot to do it i can't believe we're gonna count on how many flapjacks they got we're going over the red team one two three flapjacks way to go all right now we're coming over the gold team one two three four five yeah. six gold team wins yeah. that start. one flapjack Go back and award the points. For winning that stunt, we're gonna give the gold team 25 points. Now we're going to our question. Girls, listen up. In that stunt, you were short order cooks. If you were a real short order cook, you'd probably cook pancakes on a barbecue pit, a wok, or a griddle. <laughs> Pam's quick on the buzzer. A griddle. A griddle's right for 25 points. And the question are literally keeping the red team in the game. We got a tie, 50 points apiece. We're going to the next stunt, girls. Are you ready? Let's go, girls. Oh, yeah. Did you know that the strongest wind in history is over 200 miles per hour? It was on top of Mount Washington in New Hampshire. Well, these kids, <laughs> well, you kids in New Hampshire are going to flip over this stunt because the guys are about to build snowmen in the middle of a windy Mount Washington blizzard. Now, uh... Put on your hat, scarves, and mittens, because I can feel the wind kicking up already. Ooh, here's what they're going to have to do. When I say go, they're going to take these giant, wet, gloppy, funhouse snowballs and build their snowmen on these wooden sticks back here. Then they're going to come over here, and uh, they're going to put on the carrot nose, the uh, coal black eyes, the corn cob pipe, branches for the arms, a top hat, and a scarf. First one to put every piece of the snowman together correctly is going to win the points. Oh, and... Uh, Guess what, everybody? You're not going to believe this one. It's snowing. I love this. All right, on your mark. Ooh, it's cold. Get set. Go! shake his hand. Red team did a great job. They won that stunt. We're going back to award the points. Let's go. Yeah. For winning that stunt, we're going to give the red team 25 points. Ooh, it's very cold in here. Now we're going to our question. Listen up, guys. To make real snowmen, you have to live in a place with lots of snow. Which of these countries gets the most snow? Egypt, 
Mexico or Switzerland? Adam. Switzerland. Switzerland's right for 25 points. The red team came on strong. They got the lead after something on 100 points. Gold team's got 50. Coming up, it's time for the Funhouse Grand Prix race. That's the event that's going to lead one of our teams to the awesome Funhouse. We'll check you out at the starting line. Let's go, team. and New Hampshire to do some awesome skiing. But they're late for a plane, so when I say go, the girls are gonna dash around the track. And when they get to the luggage and skis, they're gonna grab them. When they get to the revolving door at the airport, they're gonna go through it. When they come to their tickets, they're just gonna pick them up. And they're gonna add to their score by grabbing these 10 and 25 point tokens all around the track. Remember, if they drop a token, it's out of play. Now, once the girls finish their lap, they're gonna hand off their skis and bags to their teammates. The guys are gonna switch lanes for the second lap, picking up ski boots, bags, and their tickets. First team across the finish line gets 25 points. Don't forget, it's anyone's game, we're going to the race. Is everyone ready? Yeah. All right, on your mark. Get set, go. <laughs> It is snowing! There we go. We're starting to get on the skis and grab those tokens. Make the switch. Switch lane. Switch lane. Help them out. Get those tokens in the bag before we go back. We're going to award the points. Let's go. All right. We're coming in here. They won the race. The gold team, they get the 25 points and some snow. Good work, guys. All right. Now we're going to go to the gold team's tokens first. Bring on those tokens. All right. We're going to the white ones. One, two, three, four, five, six. And seven. Now we're going to the blues. One, two, three, four, five. That's a lot of tokens. They have 270 points. Wow. That's a lot of points. All right, you're going to need a lot of tokens. We're going to the whites. One, two, three, four, five. Now we're going to the blues. One, two, three. That gives the red team 225. Gold team is going to the final. Way to go. All right. Red team played a great game. Tiny, what are we giving them? Each of you received this incredibly groovy clothing. EJ Katano Katano Boy has created a look for you. Sportswear, swimwear, jeans, accessories, and much, much more. EJ Katano and Katano Boys at a store near you. And all Funhouse contestants take home shoes furnished by British Knights. It's more fun to wear British Knights with a super cool gold BK punch. All right, we're also going to give them the home game of the Funhouse. It's here for the red team. Yeah. All right. High five. Way to go. You're on your way to the Funhouse for a ton of cash and prizes. You guys ready? Yeah. All right, everyone in the audience is going to join us. We'll see you in a minute. Let's go. for a ton of cash and prizes. But first, let's show them exactly what's in the funhouse. Tiny. Hello, Melonhead. You could start out by pushing through the small, tall hall to the alligator swamp. Then head on up to the prize mat. Pull the right knob and you both win the Opus telephone. Lift the receiver and Opus turns his head. Works with any system. A real phone? That's real fun. From Tycho. Be careful crossing the drawbridge. Then either splash into our balloon lagoon or rush to the top of the ice mountain. When the condo's there, you'll find a tag that wins you both karate lessons. Both of you learn to be black belts and master the martial arts. Hi-ya! 
Next, take a jump into the Funhouse Dump, boys. Then tumble through the Thundermat Dryer, where you both could win the Baldwin Explorer Portable MIDI Electronic Keyboard with 16 solo voices, 16 automatic rhythms, and built-in stereo speakers. Cool. From the Baldwin Piano and Organ Company. Next, add a pass for the bad case. Find the tag that wins you both 10 round-trip tickets to Catalina. You're sailing off to Avalon Bay on fun-filled Catalina Island or board Catalina Cruises, the largest ships to Catalina with daily departures from either Long Beach or San Pedro. Next, dare to get chewed by the chomping choppers. Then clang through the giant wind chimes to find the tag that wins you both. Concord's AW905 35mm camera. Features fully automatic wind, advanced and rewind, plus focus-free lens. Oi! The in-fashion in-jeans camera with built-in flash from Concord Camera. Or you could squeeze your way through the tire tunnel. Uh and then get dripping wet in the shower room. There's only one of its seven doors will unlock. A different door every day. Next, head on upstairs into my room. I'm waiting behind one of these doors, and you both could win Skyway's Freestyle 1988 Street Seat. Featuring Spin Master 2, molded wheels, and high tensile steel from Skyway Recreation Products. All these prizes, plus a thousand bucks in cash tags. Oi. All on today's Fun House. Yeah, who's going first? Listen up, David. When I say go, I want you to tear in the fun house, grab any three tags you want. Come on out here, high five Barbie. And Barbie's going in there for three more tags. And don't forget today's secret power prize tag. Let's show our viewers where it is. If one of you pulls the secret power prize tag, the two of you are going on this great vacation. Tiny, you'll be going to Florida. And you'll be staying at the Smith's Village Hotel Orlando. It offers families great town outside of villas that are 97 secluded lakefront acres with access to water sports and only 10 minutes from Disney World. And we'll be flying you and a parent from Los Angeles to Florida on Delta Airlines. You receive the complete fantastic flyer membership package with games, puzzles, and prizes from Delta, the official airline for kids. Can I go? Yeah. All right. I hope you guys win that trip. All right, up on the stairs and set our timer for two minutes. Going to the fun house. Ready? Go, David. So bad. We finally got it. Wow. All right, now he's going to try to make his way out. Come on, David. Here comes David. David's trying to make his move to get down here to get his partner a chance to go back in. All right. Here comes David. Go, go, go. All right. That wasn't easy, was it, Dave? <laughs> All right, let's go. Grab the tag in the swamp. Moving and moving now. All the down on the first one. Up on the stairs, got the $100 cash tag. She's coming out. David, you should be going back in. Go fast, Barbie, go fast. Go, go. Get up here. High five. He's got that one. They didn't get the power prize. The power prize was a $50 tag on the drawbridge. That's all right. You guys did great. We're going to find out what they won. They both get the telephone. Each of them gets that musical keyboard. He went upside down 10 times to get it, but he's got it. And how much in cash for each of them? $500. For each of you. Yeah. Way to go. All right. You guys ready for a grand total? $2,698. Yeah. All right. All right.
right, tomorrow we're going to finish up our crazy salute to the state when we show you Florida, Alaska, and Hawaii like you've never seen them before. I'm J.D. Ross. We'll see you next time. Hope we make your house a fun house. Yeah! Let's join those fun-loving roommates, Jack, Chrissy, and Janet, for some fun on Three's Company, coming up next on TV 29.